Okay, time for balloons. Now I am doing live PE and it's gonna be a little fun because I'll actually get to talk to you guys and there'll be lots of kids with balloons, but I know some of you can't do live PE, so just do this video. Also, if you don't have a balloon, no problem. Here is our trash bag balloon. I'll add a link on how to make that. Just blow it up with air and they do float like a balloon but you gotta use a lot more force or a lot more power to get them up. But it's time to get started. So get your balloon, make sure you have space. There's three things or three cues I want you to remember with hitting the balloon. Also in PE we call it striking. It's another way to say hit. Striking the balloon, you're gonna keep your eyes on the balloon. You're gonna track the balloon with your eyes wherever the balloon goes, your eye falls. Another thing I want you to remember is to push it up. You can't get the balloon, you can't hit strike the balloon again if you push it down. So, all right, so make sure you're pushing it up with an upward motion, okay, when you're hitting the balloon or striking the balloon. Also, quick feet, okay? If I hit it straight up and the balloon comes to me, I'm fine. But if I hit the balloon away from me and I just stand there, I can't get the balloon. So you need to have quick feet to move into the path of the balloon wherever it goes. All right, so you're gonna do all these activities with me. We're gonna start with two hands, go for it. Two hands, oops, I stand but Hit the balloon up with two hands. Awesome, switch to one hand. Okay, now I'm gonna move to my other hand. I was using my right hand, so I'm gonna use my opposite, which is left. Doesn't matter which one you start with, just make sure you switch. Onto one finger. If I'm going too fast for you, you can always pause the video, try it, and then come back. Okay, now we've used two hands, one hand, one finger. Now I'm gonna use body parts other than our hands. Can you use elbows? Elbows. Good. Let's use um, shoulder. Top of our head. You gotta really toss it up and then punch with it with your head. Let's do knees. <laughs> right at me. Keep feet. Kind of like you're punting. This one's kind of fun. Now, crab position. This one's actually kind of hard. A crab position. Hands down, feet down, bottom up. So you're gonna be kicking with your feet, but you gotta move fast when the balloon gets away from you. All right, and toss it up to start. I'm gonna move my body to get to it. This is good for muscular strength. Alrighty, next one. Oh, let's try sitting. So we talked about quick feet, but this one, your feet can't move because you're sitting crisscrossed applesauce. So it's really important you hit it straight up and not out. If for some reason you do hit it out, get up, grab it, and then you can always come back and start over. Nice work. This next one, we're gonna use a different body part every time. So if I hit it with my hand, then I need to hit it with my head and my knee, mixing up the body parts. I'm going to call out what I'm using. You don't have to use the same ones. Just make sure you're using different ones. Head, elbow, nose, shoulder, knee, shoulder, foot, hand, head, elbow. All right, let's try that one more time. Keep your eyes on the balloon. Quick feet and pushing up. Nose, elbow, knee, foot, knee, finger. 
finger, nose, head, elbow. Awesome! <laughs> Hopefully you didn't see that. Moved a little too close to the video. Now we're going to try some volleyball skills. Okay? You're going to put your um, thumb and your index finger together. Bend and push straight up. I got to go farther back. Bend, push straight up. Bend, push straight up. We're going to call it, that's called the set. And the goal is to send it up high. How high can you get that balloon? Some of you might be a little limited by your ceiling. All right, try a couple more. Awesome. Next, the bump. So I want you to put your arms together. Keep your arms nice and flat. We're going to be hitting this part of our arm with the balloon, not our hands. This is the volleyball bump. So bend your knees, bring it up. If you notice I'm just hitting straight up, I'm not swinging it behind me because if I swing behind me, the blue is not there. All right, let's do a couple more. All right, time for our tennis racket. We're gonna use our hand as our tennis racket. Toss it, whack it. <laughs> Try again, go get your balloon. Get it away like I did. Okay, bring your arm back. Flat hand like it's the racket head. And whack it. Just a couple more of those. Next we're going to be doing our tennis serve. We're going to toss it straight up in the air. With our hand we're going to come up over like it's a tennis racket and slam it down. siblings around, maybe your grandma's helping out, she has time. You can practice hitting back and forth, but if you don't, you can use a wall. A harder wall is better. I'm going to use this mat though because my brick wall will pop my balloon. Alright, so I'm just going to hit it. I'm going to need to use a lot of force to get it to bounce back to me. <laughs> and if it doesn't work well, whoops, try it again. Nice work. And don't forget, eyes on the balloon, push up, and quick feet move to the path of the balloon. Have a great day.